the lake is a cold water lake yeah and this lake is the place where our writer E.B. White was died okay and most probably you if you visit Japlang yeah you will see a stream a stream you know and the stream if you visit over there in winter season if you want to take bath in that stream water you might get cold because the water is so cold and at the same time the water is very chilly chilly weather okay weather is chilly at the winter time when the bridge gentle bridge will come then you will start trembling oh yeah i am getting cold yeah though the month winter month hasn't been started yet okay so the same situation over here in this lake that is the lake of main the lake of main and it is in the north western part of america okay and this area has a special name especially this area is called new england that means the people who started their journey from england and first time they went this area so this area was covered by the people they are from they are from they, they are from england and most of them are protestant good thank you very smart yeah thank you so that is uh, new england and for this reason this area is called new england and especially there are several mountains as a sink to the lake okay as you have seen in that yeah here yeah you you see lake and also the several mountains are there and the mountains lake and ocean are the greatest and beautiful creation of almighty and for this reason if you feel sad you might visit cactus brother to watch the ocean so to uh, after watching the vastness of the ocean all of your sadness will be evaporated evaporated means at the same time if you go close to the mountain mountain at the very front side of your nose if you see a big mountain is standing over there and you will be glad ah you will be glad that means yeah i want to be as big as the mountain just to touch the tip of the mountain isn't so the main lake this lake is very good and also at the below of this mountains we see this beautiful lake that is the lake of get and also accompanied the mountain some other scenery yes there there is another river actually this lake was issued issued means from the water this lake is created or made the river is kenbeck river and several rural townships border like the lake and green mile is by far the largest town of the lake okay so this is the lake on which background our writer eb white wrote a prose the name of the prose is one more to the lake what's the lake the lake of okay childhood memories are very good okay actually eb white is a uh essayist that means he wrote several essays he wrote several short stories so especially he has written children books but this written this prose that we are going to study that is not based on children's liking however this prose is related to the reminiscence reminiscence you know 
That means the nostalgic idea. That means what's the nostalgic idea? That means the imaginative journey towards childhood. Many of you might think that yes, if we get our childhood back again, what do you think? Amra jodi our shishu der moto hota, school, school nahi, puri khani, carefree life. When was he born? He was born in 1899. And he wrote this. He wrote this prose that means once more to the lake in 1942. It means that uh, at the time he was 42 years old. 42 years old and the lake we have seen in the picture that the lake is around the lake our writer E.B. White was born and brought up and he stayed there until 1915 nearly 15 or 16 years he that means our writer E.B. White passed his time surrounding the lake area okay and in 1941 whenever he is writing this prose at the time through the help of your of his imagination he went back to that lake that lake in which it was light in nearly 25 years back in our writer's age, when the right, our writer was only 15 or 16 years old, that means he was an adolescent boy. Adolescent, you know, that means a teenage. So everything you will see that through the passage of time, our writer's imagination, writer's physical structure, writer intellectual likings, everything has been changed. Simultaneous, the lake has already been changed in several ways. So the prose, whenever he was writing, then he tried to get the imagination of his 16 years age. What was the lake like nearly 25 years back? Pochish Bosor Age Jokon Amade writer at Boyers Chilo, Sholo Bosor, Tokon She Lekta Kichilo, She Lekta, Kalpuna Shokir Mal Tundi, She Pochish Bosor Age Cholegi Chilo. That is about the approach. That means once more to the once more means once again. One summer, alone about in nineteen oh four. This is the actual approach, okay? And E.B. White, once again, at the very starting point, most probably you have got the email, that is, I sent you the email, that means the text of this approach. And there you see the first two slides, that is, E.B. White was born in 1998, uh, and he was died in 1985 began his career as a professional writer with the newly founded New Worker magazine in 1920s. Over the years, he produced 19 books, including collection of essays, the famous children books, Stuart Little and Charlotte's Wave, and the young popular writing textbook, The Elements of the Style. We have learned about this writing in our previous class when uh, we had been discussing the biography of E.B. White. Here in this lake, that means he said that one summer, that means every summer, the writer's family were having party towards the lake. Along about 1904, that means near to 1904 or 19. My father rented a camp on a lake in Maimi, Maine, and took us all there for the months of August. Okay. Actually, uh, life is 
a combination of several years okay and especially if you pass the busy time then your mind might have some relaxation and for this reason we make a study tour we make uh, uh, sightseeing in our life okay and whenever if a child if a child gets more opportunity to visit several areas that will create their mind more confident and they the places the children will be visiting that places and the images of the places will be inscribed inscribed you know inscribed in the mind of the children in 1904 when our writers were only 5 or 6 years old at the time our writers father hired a camp camp you know it is not a house it's not a hotel it's a camp camp that means uh, tented house tent you know tabur modhe basha ebong shekhane tara puro august mas ta thakbe ebong sei tent ta kothay bhara korechilo ei main lake je lake tar amra chobi dekhlam ei lake er they will be staying one month over there in the tent we all got renowned from some kittens and had to wrap ponds extract on our may arms and legs night and morning and my father rose over uh, in a canoe and all his clothes on but outside of that the vacation was a success and from then on none of us ever ever thought that there was any place in the world like that lake of many whenever our writer with the old family a canoe is a small type of boat yeah most probably you may watch yeah this is a canoe yeah it's not a boat that will be driven by engine motor engine it's a boat that you have to driving with the help of horse horse you know boita okay and some two or three people might sit together and they will go in the ocean and uh, one important thing is that this this small type of boat will not have engine so it will not have extra sounds if you close our eyes and try to listen what's the sound you are getting here here if you close your eyes and hear the sound rickshaw horn and one crow is also crying yeah so this is small type of boat will not have such kind of sound pollution so in that canoe they packed up all the things and they went to over there in that house okay and they they had been they would be we returned summer after summer that means every summer in winter born country they will have two or three months summer season and at that time they try to enjoy their life the utmost way they can okay naturally it's such kind of tendency has been increased in bangladesh as well many people are go out for outing go out for outing is it not outing means a picnic one type of picnics many people visit that so at the time our writer see the white family every summer they would go close to the main lake to have their holidays holidays summer holidays okay and every summer they would go over there i have since become a salt water man and but sometimes in summer there was a days when the restlessness of the tides and the fear could go to the old sea water and the incessant wind that blows across the afternoon and into the evening make me wish for the placidity of the lake in the woods yeah okay in winter season there will be no raining there will be no rustling sounds of the 
uh, storm, yeah, storm. What is the difference between storm and gentle breeze? In the storm, accompanied by the raining, we will have the gust of winds. Batashet je goti beke ta onik beshi thake chhodir modhe. But jeta amra onno shomoy dekhi shit kalle ei chhodir goti beke ta thake na. So at that time there is a placid look. That means calm and quiet atmosphere around the lake whenever the writer's family would visit to that lake across the pleasant sea water incessant wind incessant means incessant the wind was coming without taking any break okay so that is coming and the blows across the afternoon and in the evening make me wish for the placidity of the lake of the woods okay he thought that it is the only one lake of this world where he have some he will have some mental happiness every year in the summer season a few weeks ago this feeling got so strong i bought myself a couple of brush hooks and a spinner and returned to the lake where we used to go for a week's fishing and to revisit our ponds in the writer's 25 20 42 years ek Poetry was a rage from visit as soon as he had been thinking, and he hired a canoe and he went over there. Over where in this lake? Actually, fishing is a one kind of hobby, is it? The people who will be fishing they will know what are the fishing ports or fishing areas are there. Okay. So it's such a calm lake, it will be a very fantastic idea that if you go out over there for fishing, Masbharar Jannu, Boshi Diya Masbharar Anakir Shok, a Boshi Diya Masbharar Jodi, Karo Shok Tange, Kothai Boshi Kaha Jai, Kothai Masbharar Te Pada Jai, Shok Erekata, Tadir Jana Thang. Our writer thought that, yeah, how would be the idea that if I go out once again, in that lake, Maine, for fishing what would be and as soon as he had been thinking he purchased some fishing materials and went over there in that lake okay i took along my son and had never had any fresh water up his nose and who had seen lily pads oh, only from the train windows yeah actually you may have your holidays yeah but our writer's son that means i don't know we don't know exactly what is in his age but our writer said that means my son has seen water lilies okay lily fuller water lilies je pata gulo bheshe thake mone hoy ek ekta thalar moto boro boro e writer er sele she gulo dekheche kintu kothay dekheche train er janla diye that means he got, haven't got the touch of the fresh water. Many of you, when you go close to the ocean, you try to touch the ocean water. Ah, so chill, so cool. And as soon as you will get the temperature of the ocean water, your mind will be as cool as the ocean water's coolness, is it? So our writer said that my son didn't have the experience of getting touched to the fresh water. And only he has seen the water lily uh, uh, lips through the window so our writer took his son with him and on our journey over the lake i began to wonder what it would be like after nearly 30 years our writer is revisiting the south our writer had been thinking that hey, what would be the lake like a trish bhasure lake avastha ki has the leg been old? Yeah. So he had been wondering. Wondering means thinking. Yeah. I wondered how time would have marked his uniqueness. Uniqueness means the writer said that means this is a unique leg. According to his description, that means lake of mine. Mind be, might be the only one lake of this world where there is a combination of lake, ocean and mountains. So it was a unique. 
our writer had been thinking that the uniqueness is still that uniqueness is preserved or not. Okay. And the hall is for the cups and the streams, streams, you know, actually. Ah, stream, what's the difference of streams and the river? A stream will have a very good sound of falling water. Okay. So the streams over there and also the hills and the sun set behind and the camps and the paths behind the camps. So there was the camps, that means many people will be visiting over there. And many people are uh, sleeping. Many people will be sitting on the camps. And in that camps, uh, <laughs> actually if I would be sitting on the chair, I would be this. Actually, this is the story of the day. I the next of the If we get the background music on my side, we will go ahead. to get the background music on my side, now let me go to Hamana. Okay, so the dizziness will be there. So, you can, you can, Understand the uh, uh, understand the calmness of that area. So the matter of fact, how to shake up for power? Just to shake up the journal party for a shop. Or do not shake up the shop. So serene and so calm that must be all over there. They were going. I was sure that the third road would have been found it out, and I wanted it. There was there was also a road as I sent to the. Ah, if you visit Cox's Bazaar, you will see a road that is Marine Drive. Ah, it is nearly 40, 40 kilometers road. Okay, at the right side you will see the ocean, the vast ocean, and on the left side you will see the mountains. Okay, and through the smooth road, you will watching the both sides. If you make your eyes in a two angled way, one eyes, if you put hand together, one eyes you will be watching the ocean and one eye will be the mountain and you will move, yeah. If you drive the car on self, that you can't see, yeah. But the way people visit there, they will visit there with the Chandir Gari, okay. Chandir Gari te iruko muka muki kore Okay, just like a fan. So it is not possible. So here, in this lake, there was a peach road as well, tart log. A lake in Pasha Aroki road, Silo She road, Guloki, Chilo, Pichet Rastao Chilo. Okay. And he wondered that. And another thing is that. Okay. So calmness. Ah, uh, do you know the population of Dhaka city? Dhaka city, Janushanka Kato, Kato. What is the population of Bangladesh at present now? Uh, yeah, according to the last census, it is more than 18 crore. Yeah, but among Shalokoti, yes. And uh, how many people have been living in Dhaka city out of the 16 crore people of Bangladesh? And, uh, uh, no, 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 no. More than I pro people live in Dhaka city. Yeah. So it's a very densely populated city. A Paskoti Manush, Protidin Jodi, an Ortek Porimano Manush Jodi Protidin actor could a dim kai, that at Haka Shahore dim kai the lagbe. Arai Koti. Jodi Charjone Akjon actor could a dim kai, the Halekoti. Okay, I don't know if Murgi Dim at Dambar. But our concern is that, and for this reason, many people da, do not want to live in Dhaka city. They want to live the hilly areas, Kaksas, uh, Bandarban, Hagachari, and the, these are the less dense populated area. Here, in this lake area, that means the lake area of men, that was desolated. That area, no people, you will be driving over there, but 
you will not be crossed by any people over there so that people was very isolated isolated means kuno jonoshokha ekdom i nei apni apnar nijer moto kore anondo korte parben kintu coxes bazar e isolated place e there is a problem of security concern yeah okay so that is the importance of this lake area so in this lake area it's uh, it there are no many people are there okay it is a strength how much you can remember about the class like and once you allow your mind to return into the group so who is a lead back you remember one thing that suddenly reminds of you of another thing so the calmness and the serenity of this area reminds the writer in his bag i guess i remember the clearest of all the early mornings now he had been thinking what he would do as the 30 bochor age when the writer had been visiting this lake area what he would do now he is remembering when the lake was cool and motionless remember how the bedroom smelled and of the lumber it was made of j jekhane kobira ki bhasha bhara korto tabu ei tabur sayani ta kibhabe thake te ei je ar bed ta thake ki diye kaather bed thake kaath diye bed toiri kora chilo jeta ke bola hoy lumber এবং এই কাঠ দিয়ে যে বেড তৈরি করা হতো এই কাঠের যে একটা স্মেল গন্ধ আসতো সেই গন্ধ তারা পেত রাইটার হ্যাজ বিন থিঙ্কিং আই এম গেটিং দ্য স্মেল অফ দ্য লাম্বার বিকজ আই হ্যাভ বিন ইমাজিনিং ইন লিভিং ইন দ্যাট ক্যাম্প অ্যান্ড হুজ উড সেন্ট ইন্টার থ্রু দ্য স্ক্রিন অ্যান্ড হি হ্যাড বিন স্লিপিং উইথ ইন দ্য ক্যাম্প অ্যান্ড হি ওয়াজ গেটিং দ্য স্মেল অফ লাম্বার উডস the partition of the camp were thin and didn't extend clear to the top of the rooms and as i was always the first woke up there are many people okay a few days back actually and uh, previous set and some people said to me that means i will be coming over here in this park at 5 am i said 5 am uh, yeah i like to go out at dark our writer ebi white also had the habit of going out or getting out from their bed early in the morning so he had been noticing early in the morning he had, he had been getting out of his sleep early in the morning and he started dress softly as not to wake the others khub aste aste she utto uthe dress porto karon baire jawar jonno dress porte hobe and then sneak out into the sweet outdoors এবং আস্তে করে চুরি করে কাউকে কারো ঘুমের ডিস্টার্ব না করে সে কি করতো বাইরে চলে যেত স্টার্ট আউট ইন দা ক্যানু তারপরে কোথায় বসতো এই ছোট নৌকা তারপরে কি করতো অ্যান্ড কিপিং ক্লোজ অ্যালং দ্য শোর অ্যান্ড উইথ দ্য লং শ্যাডোস অফ দ্য পাইন অ্যান্ড দেন হি স্টার্টেড গোয়িং টু দ্য লেক অ্যান্ড দে আর দ্য পাইন পাইন ইজ দ্য লার্জেস্ট ট্রিস ইন দ্য হিলি এরিয়াস এই পাইন গাছগুলো অনেক লম্বা হয় এবং এই লম্বা গাছের ছায়াগুলো যে পানিতে পড়তো যদিও সকালে আসলে ছায়া কিভাবে পড়তো সেটা একটা বেশি বিষয় বিকজ দ্যাট ওয়াজ দ্য ওয়াটার ওয়াজ ভেরি ভেরি ট্রান্সপারেন্ট ইউনো অনেক স্বচ্ছ পানি এবং স্বচ্ছ পানিতে এই বড় লম্বা পাইন গাছগুলোর ছায়া পড়তো এবং তার মধ্য দিয়ে সে চুরি করে একা একা সকালে উঠে কেনু নিয়ে যেত দ্যাট হি ওয়াজ হি ওয়াজ রিমেম্বারিং I remember being very careful never to rub my paddle against the gum oil okay to fear of disturbing the stillness of the cathedral okay that means we have seen there is a paddle isn't it a paddle ta hocche hat diye chalaite hoy just like yes this way and he was very careful so that they, this will not the chance the sight of the kenu if it touch the side of the cano that you will creating some sound cano shobdo korto na karon shobdo korle ei ei je stillness the calmness eta noshto hoye jabe shobder shobdo dushon okay so he was very careful at the time and the lake had never been you would call a wild lake what is wild animal yes that means when uh, the wild dog will start barking if it sees you one time 
but the pet animal will not bark. Yeah. In the same way, there are two kinds of leg. One wild leg, and another pet leg. Yeah. The wild leg will have the sound of barking. What's the sound of barking? Just like the sound of motor engines. Yeah. Sound of others thing will be happening in the legs. That is called wild leg. Okay. And the tame leg or the pet leg will be the leg where the writer would visit. There are cottages is, is sprinkled around the shore and it was the farming all through the shores of the lake were quite heavily wooded. Actually, there are several cottages. Choto choto cottages mane kintu abar ei bhara kora pari na. Choto 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 small houses, thatch, thatch roof. Thatch roof means eglote hoche ki khod diye hoche sab toiri kora hoy. Eglo cottages. So thatch roof uh, cottages will be there and the uh, uh, the lake was quite heavily wooded. And some of the cottages are owned by the nearby farmers and would live at the shore and ate your meals in the farmhouse. So the, why, uh, the, 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 the author was describing the scenery that was within the lake and that's what our family did. But although it was not wild, it was a fairly large and undisturbed lake and there were places in which to a child at least seemed infinitely remote and primeval. Okay, so if a child visit over there, mona korbe je she onik ager shobbotai pire gye se. Je kani kono manush jor nai, mona hobe ag theke dui hajar ager kono shobbotai she pire gye se. If anybody visit this area, it was right about the tar and it lay within the half a mile of the shore. When I got back there with my boy and we settled into a camp near and the farmhouse into the kind of summer town I had owned. I could tell that it was going to be pretty much the same as it had been before. I knew it, lying in bed in the first morning, smelling the bedroom and hearing the boy sneak quietly out and go, and go off along the shore in the boat. So the writer had been thinking that he has gone to the lake when 30 years. Back. And he had been imagining everything what he did in his early child's age of childhood. That was the first part. Yeah. And after many things, he actually he had some illusion. Yeah, I sustained the illusion. Illusion, you know, what kind of uh, suppose uh, you had been thinking your mother or you had been thinking your father while you were sleeping in your mess house or in your hostel's house early in the morning you are getting up and you see your mother is standing before you it's called illusion okay now our writer was getting illusion that uh, he was thinking and he seemed that he is living in a dual ex existence he is now 42 years old and whenever he is thinking about the leg he has seen that he has gone, he has become a child of 10 years. So he has the dual existence of living a 10 years boy and also a 42 years old man. So he is, and he is, uh, he went to fishing the next morning. So at the time he had been fishing, okay. The small waves were the same chuckling of the rowboat under the chain of the fist anchor. Okay, so everyone, and he also watched that Several uh, streams were there, several water sources over there, everything were there. There are some water spots over there. And also at the time of the fishing, he got the presence of a kind of fish. That kind of fish is a mackerel. Okay. And lots of fishing will be there. And also a school of minnows swam by. Whenever he was going with the help of his boat, he saw a number of minnows. Minnows means? Macher Pona. They were going in a number. Jhaag Bede Ora, Nodi De Chala Phera Kore. Jokon writer, Nokani Rachilo, he also saw the minnows. And his minnows are still small individual shadow doubling in attendance. Mottekta Macher Pona, they are going 
এবং প্রত্যেকটা মাসের আবার আলাদা করে একটা ছবি পড়েছে মনে হচ্ছে প্রত্যেকটা মাসের আলাদা ছবি ওকে সো দ্যাট সিন ওয়াজ অলসো ভেরি চার্মিং টুয়ার্ডস আওয়ার রাইটার ইবি হোয়াইট অ্যান্ড আপ টু দ্য ফার্ম হাউস টু ডিনার থ্রু দ্য টেমিং ডাস্টি ফিল অ্যান্ড অ্যাট দ্য ডিনার টাইম দে হ্যাড দেয়ার ডিনার টুয়ার্ডস দেয়ার ফার্ম হাউস and that was the situation they had been doing in this area summer time summer time pattern of life in in deliable the fat proof of leg the woods unshatterable the pasture with the sweet fern and the jupiter uh, juniper forever and ever so there was another tree one tree is pine another tree jupiter we have also the bunch of minnows and everything and the american flag floating against the white clouds of the blue sky and there you will see there will some flag post over there and that was the american family at play and you also see that some other families went in that area 